marvelous Monday, friends. Um, here's can we don't say that. Here is today's devotion. So let me open it. And keep one little bit. Okay, um Jesus today number thirty-five. Though I bring grief, I will show compassion. So do not despair when hard times come your way. And do not try to escape them prematurely. Timing is my prerogative. There is a time for everything. And a season for every activity under, under heaven. Grief is a season. And I will use it for your good. Unlike the four seasons of the year, the seasons of your life are not orderly or predictable. When you're grieving, you may feel as if sorrow will accompany you for the rest of your days. But remember that I have promised to show you compassion. So great is my unfailing love for you. When you are suffering, Search for signs of my merciful presence. Even during your darkest days, streaks of light break through the storm clouds, providing hope and comfort. My unfailing love shines upon you always. Look up to me and see my face shining down upon you. I never run out of compassion. They are new every morning. So, the reflection, how quickly I forget that just getting out of my house and going to Starbucks rejuvenates my day and makes me so excited. I was dictating this devotion and was about to do it live, but I was a blubbering mess. I took a few minute run to Starbucks where I was blessed beyond measure. One of my friends came in and said that it was such a blessing to see me, and he thought, if I can smile, then he, then so can he. That made me realize how much I need to get out of my house so I can get out of my head and see people. That was exactly what my friend said after he explained that it was such a blessing to see me. Meaning he needs to get out of his house to get out of his head too. So now the bubbling tears, the bubbling tears are tears of joy. So I'm excited now, although I'm panicking because something that wasn't supposed to happen for so I thought a lot later it has now been moved up a little bit. So I thought I was gonna prepare something else today today but it might have to wait till tomorrow so the shake might be it for today i hope you guys enjoyed that and the bible verses are though the lord brings grief he will show compassion so great is his unfailing love lamentation 332 and then there is a time for everything and I see them for every activity under heaven. Ecclesiastes 3, 1. And then, the Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. Number 6, 25. New King James Version. And the last verse is, it is Lamentations 3, 22 through 24. Though the Lord's mercies are not with. Through the Lord's mercies we are not consumed, because his compassions fail not. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. The Lord is my portion, says my soul. Therefore I hope in him. Lamentations 3, 22 through 24. So that was today's devotion. And now I'm not panicking and blubbering mess. I'm just panicking as things got 
I'll turn and change, so I won't be cooking what I planned tonight, but hopefully I will soon. Thank you guys so much. Hope you have a wonderful day. And it's kind of maybe rainy looking outside, but it says it's not going to rain at all today on the forecast. But then I was told also that it may rain later, so I'm not sure. You know, Colorado has crazy weather, so whatever's going to happen, I'm in my house, so I'm okay, and I'm my house. Oh, and you know what else, guys? So I always call my electric chair my electric chair, but now I know why they call it a power chair. Because if you're saying, oh, I'm sitting in my electric chair, you know, like the electric chair is what they do for the death penalty or, or they used to do so that it's like oh yeah not my electric chair power chair so sure then now I'm not my power chair so have a good home and a fabulous hope you guys have a wonderful day god bless you and keep smiling thank you thank you oh I'm doing my kind of talk mm. Thank you. Mm -hmm.